Lately I've been showing you how to do things on the OnePlus 3, like installing a custom recovery, making backups, restoring, deleting backups, rooting your device, and installing exposed framework, which is all done through a custom recovery. If you have a custom recovery installed though, it has modified the system partition and that means you cannot install an over-the-air update directly from OnePlus. So if you're looking to install an over-the-air update directly from OnePlus, or maybe you're just tired of having a custom recovery, today I'm going to show you how to install and revert back to the stock recovery for the OnePlus 3. If you haven't already done so, you're going to need to inst you're going to need to enable developer mode. And then you're going to need to toggle USB debugging on. If you don't know how to enable developer mode, just check in the description below and there will be a link to the full tutorial that talks all about that. You're also going to need to have ADB installed on your computer. And again, if you don't have this, be sure to check the link in the description below and that will tell you how to install that to your computer. Once you have the minimal ADB and Fastboot installed, go ahead and double click on the shortcut it created. And then it's going to launch a command prompt that you see here. From here, you're going to type ADB space devices and then press enter on the keyboard. This will start the ADB service. Once the ADB service has been started, we need to connect the OnePlus 3 to the PC. And if you have never allowed USB debugging access from this PC before, you're going to get this prompt. Let's go ahead and toggle the Always Allow from this computer option and then tap on OK. After you have granted USB debugging access to the OnePlus 3, then we can go ahead and download the stock recovery image file. If you check the description down below, again, you'll find a link to the full tutorial, and that tutorial will have the direct link to the download for this stock recovery image. Once you have downloaded that file, you're going to want to copy or move it to the same installation folder as the minimal ADB and Fastboot tools are. So your folder should look something like this. We have ADB, we have Fastboot, we have the support files, and then we have the recovery image. Now that we have the recovery image file in the ADB and Fastboot folder, we can proceed to boot the OnePlus 3 into Fastboot mode. Again, if you're not familiar with how to do this, check the full tutorial. It tells you all about it. Fastboot mode is also known as bootloader mode. So we're just going to reboot into bootloader mode from the advanced power menu. And once the OnePlus 3 is in fast boot mode, we're going to turn our attention back to the command prompt. And as you can see right here, we're going to type the command fast boot space flash space recovery space recovery.img. And once you have all that typed in, just press enter on the keyboard. And you're not going to see any changes on the phone. 
but you will see that it is sending and writing that recovery to the one plus three. Then we're going to press the volume down button a couple of times to highlight recovery mode. And then we're going to press the power button. And we're just going to do this to verify that the stock recovery is back on the one plus three. See before this would boot up to twerp. But now we are at the stock recovery for the one plus three.